US President Joe Biden is deeply disappointed with the Supreme Court gun decision that struck down a New York law restricting access to concealed carry permits Thursday. Am I disappointed in the pre- I will answer this one question. And I was just talking to the governor of New York about this. I am disappointed in the Supreme Court gun decision. Um, there is one little bit of solace in the uh, the uh, the minority making up the majority opinion has laid out that it affects not every state. It affects only 40 states, a lot of states it affects. And the phrase that I, I found no- noticeable was, there's a difference between states that say may and, they, and say shall. The, if you have to say you shall give, you shall do A, B, C, they're the ones that are going to have problems. But most say may. I mean, may and, and I got it reversed, may and shell. And so there are, the gun laws in 40 of these states are still in place based on the decision. Not good enough, but it's, uh, I think it's a bad decision. I think it's, I think it's not reasoned accurately, but I'm disappointed. The U.S. Supreme Court struck down as unconstitutional New York State's limits on carrying concealed handguns in public, handing a landmark victory to gun rights advocates in a nation deeply divided over how to address firearms violence. The 6-3 ruling, with the court's conservative justices in the majority and liberal justices in dissent, found that the state's law, enacted in 1913, violated a person's right to keep and bear arms under the U.S. Constitution's Second Amendment. The justices overturned a lower court ruling, throwing out a challenge to the law by two gun owners and the New York affiliate of the National Rifle Association, an influential gun rights group closely aligned with Republicans.